everybody, it's me, Michelle, and I have baby Brooklyn here. This is our second night without baby Aaliyah. So, she left us um, yesterday morning. Yeah, yesterday morning. So, she is on her long journey home. And baby Brooklyn is still in her cute little monkey outfit that she that we put her in for our trip to take baby Aaliyah to the post office. So I thought we would do a video of putting her in her little pajama outfit. It's one of her new ones that she hasn't wore yet. And yesterday we went shopping at um, a new Walmart. Another Walmart, a different Walmart than we normally shop at. Um, after we took baby Leah to the post office, we um, went and picked some family, some of our family up, and we all went shopping. So we got baby Brooklyn, um, a couple, a couple more sleepers. They had some really good deals at the other Walmart. And I wanted everything I saw. But we had to choose just a couple. So, and I also bought another cute little outfit. I don't think it'll fit Brooklyn, but it'll probably fit my um, sweet pea kid once she gets a body put on her so um the the shirt that goes to it is actually a uh, I think it, it kind of looks like a fourth of July outfit or a Labor Day outfit or something. They had it on sale and um the shirt actually might fit baby Brooklyn as a dress. <laughs> and it kinda it looks like it could be a dress so we might try it. But um I might do a haul video for y'all for the stuff that I bought. I still haven't uploaded the the video of us shopping yet, so I know I need to do that. Alright. And I know I keep saying I'm going to do other videos with her, and every time I plan to do it, I just get so busy that I can't, I, um, I do a lot of stuff for my mom, and then I, I have, um, an aunt that I, that doesn't have a way around, and I, um, I take her to all her doctor's appointments, and take her to pay her bills and stuff, and help her out, since I'm not working right now, I mean, I just feel like that's the least I can do. I really enjoy helping people and doing things for other people. It makes me, um, it makes me feel good to help others. So, I try to do anything and everything that I possibly can to help other people. So, I don't really have the money to help them money-wise, but if I can do anything else, you know, for them. I'm just putting, um, I just put some baby lotion on my hands and rubbed it in and I'm just kind of touching it on her to make her smell good. So, but, um, and I, I mean, I clean my mom's house and I do all her laundry and stuff, so I stay pretty busy and then, of course, taking care of my own house and cooking and cleaning and doing the clothes for um, my fiance and you know, making sure he has work clothes laid out and making sure he has mm, hot meals to eat when he gets up and 
to get ready for work and when he gets home from work. And sometimes he he works on the railroad, so he works all kinds of crazy hours. So sometimes I'm up at two and three in the morning cooking. I'm up all kinds of hours of the night and day cooking and cleaning because a lot of times when he gets when he works a lot of nights I get I get on his schedule with my sleeping so it's kind of hard so if y'all ever see like comments or something for me from crazy hours that's why I get on his schedule a lot so Just love her little piggies. I am um, I'm actually fixing to start on some more babies. So I've had a lot of people um, ask if baby Aaliyah was still for sale. Um, as you know, if you've watched all my videos, she is sold. Um, I, I've got to to change the videos. Um, the um, title on the video is to sold, so I just hadn't had a chance. I hadn't had a chance to get around and do that. Um, but I am working on making some more. So if you're interested in getting and buying one, um, just let me know. I do plan on making another one, just like a baby Aaliyah. Um, so I am working on one, just like her, and I'm hoping to get some more molds so that I can make um, some other ones. Um, I'm actually working on buying. A mold. So, uh, this is what we're gonna put her in. Let me, make, let me see if you can see. It's got a little giraffe, a little pink giraffe, and a little gray giraffe. It's really cute. So I've got nothing on the back, but it's got a little giraffe on the beat. I'm trying to hold it still. <laughs> but I thought that's really cute. Kind of like little ruffles on the hands. There's nothing on the back though. And it's still got the tags on it because it's new. I love um, these little outfits. Carter says the cutest little outfits. I would love to buy some clothes from Jamboree. Uh, my sister-in-law actually is working at Jamboree, the Jamboree that's closest to me now, which it's not real, real close. It's a good 35, 40 minutes from me, but um, she just started working up there. She was a, was being, she was a stay-at-home mommy because my little nephew is only five months old, but, um, they really needed the money, so she had to go back to work. And, um, which I'm sure is hard for her because my little nephew is spool rotten. And he loves to be with his mama. I've only kept him once uh, by myself. And when I did, he would not let me put him down. I had to hold him the whole entire time. So I didn't have a chance to do anything. I, didn't, I couldn't even cook my fiance's supper that night. And he was not a happy camper that he did not get no dinner. <laughs> but that's just, my nephew was just so cranky. He wouldn't let me put him down. As long as I held him, though, he was the happiest little baby. And he sat and talked to me. And I just love him. I love him to death. I've got a really strong bond with him. He's my little man, but he's not little. He's chunky. He's actually wearing... Um, nine month size nine month clothing and he's only like five months old so he's a little chunky thing and his mama's a little bitty so it's <laughs> but my brother his daddy was a big baby his dad he's his daddy weighed 10 pounds 24 inches long when he was born so my mama had a time delivering him <laughs> he was a big baby <laughs> I, guess I, I guess it would be a good idea to take the tag off of it. I'm sorry. I know in my videos I just ramble. I just ramble. 
And my little dog, he's at the puppy gate. My little chihuahua, he wants in. <laughs> but I was, as I was saying, I am working on making more silicone dolls. I've had several people ask me about uh, baby Aaliyah. And um, I do plan on making another one just like her. Um, I may even make a couple more just like her. It just depends on how many people are interested in her. But um, the first person to make a deposit on the one that I'm uh, starting to work on, or the first person to pay when she's finished, is, will be the new mommy to her. So I tried doing the holding the baby thing, holding them for people with with I did it like twice. I held on to it. Really just once for a long time. I held on to baby Aaliyah for somebody without a deposit and they ended up backing out. So I can no longer hold the baby uh, for anybody. Hold a baby for anybody without a deposit. So I hate I, I I hate to, to do stuff like that. I try to work with people the best I can. I'm, I mean, because I'm... I try to be as helpful and as, you know, as easy to work with as possible. But, you know, other people mess it up for everybody. So, um, but I don't expect anybody to pay for any of the dogs, you know, until they see them. Unless, you know, they want it held for them, you know. So, if they want it held for them and they don't want anybody else to, to swipe it up, you know, then you're welcome to make a deposit on, on any of them that you want. Um, and I've had some people ask me if I was going to um, start rooting the hair on them and... I do plan on starting um, giving people the preference of having hair rooted. Um, the only thing is I, is I will probably have to charge a little more for uh, to root the hair because of the expense of the mohair. Um, I don't have any mohair um, right now, so... I will have to buy the mohair, of course. I do plan on buying um, some more mohair. Um, I'm going to buy at least one color to hold on to to uh, root the eyelashes. So they will come with uh, rooted eyelashes, more than likely. Maybe uh, Brooklyn, her eyelashes aren't rooted. Um, they're just um, on there with the... Um, with some... It's not really, it's not really glue. Um, it's the stuff that you use to put those kind of eyelashes on. But um, I forgot the name of it. It's some kind of antihensive, but um, which is like a glue. But anyways, I think they look really cute on her. Um, I may take them off later on and root them because, I mean, they you can take them off without it um, harming them without it messing her up or anything. But anyway, there's baby Brooklyn. Don't she just look so cute? Uh oh, we forgot her scratch mitts. Yeah, we forgot her scratch mitts. They just look so cute. I just love her to death. I just love her to death. I'm actually extremely, extremely excited for the little girl to get baby Aaliyah. I cannot wait till she receives her. Can't wait to to see what she thinks about her. I um I put a couple more surprises in the box after I'd already done the box packing. I um put a couple more surprises in there. I, um it wasn't a lot, but there was something in I put two little things in there that I will be sending with all my babies. Um, but I'm not going to tell you what it is because 
the um I just want the mommies when they receive my babies I want them to have something to look forward to that's a surprise that they don't know is coming with the baby and I think it's something that they'll really 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 like um I know if I were to buy a baby from somebody and they sent that with me went sent that with my baby I would be ecstatic about it I mean And it's nothing that anybody else that I know of has ever sent with any of their babies. Um, it's something of, I mean, I can't say it's nothing that nobody ain't ever sent with their babies, but the way it was made and the way it looks and everything <coughs> and the uniqueness of it, I know as far as I've seen with any of the box openings I've seen of people's videos and stuff like that. I've never seen anybody um, receive anything that looked like that. Looked like what I sent with them. Um, but it is something that you would, you know, that a lot of mommies would probably want. Um, it was really cute. I'm not going to tell you what it is. Um, but, um, Anyway, let's pick baby up, Brooklyn up, and put her in her swing. All right, this video has went way too long, but I just wanted to let y'all see how super cute. Um, baby Brooklyn's looking on her adorable little outfit. She's swinging in her swing. And I got the music turned on. Um, but anyway, yeah, if anybody's interested in, you know, any baby, any a silicone that just like baby Aaliyah, uh, just PM me or email me. I have my email on several of my videos. And uh, just let me know, because there will, there will be more um, like her. So, And hopefully there will be some more that um, from another mold that I do plan on getting. I just haven't made my mind up on exactly what mold I want yet. But I am looking at a couple of them. And, um, yeah. So, and I do, I am, I do plan on starting to try to make some boys. Um. I, um, it's just been easier for me to make the molds with the, um, to do the little girl parts, but I do need to, I do gotta, do want to do some boys, you know, so there'll be a variety of them, um, but yeah, I hope everybody has a blessed night, and, uh, thanks for watching, and talk to you later, guys, bye!